holy shit guys we've got some breaking news apparently we're going to be getting a five star selector there's going to be more improvements to the game another potential temple like there's so much more compensation that these the devs are giving us i'm super excited uh so yeah in this video we're going over a dev note that's come out from the cn social media so yeah let's get it So let's get into it. So it says here improvements on five star selector. So the source for this is a special dev note popped on popped off on the CN social media account for Wuthering Waves. Um, and this post is only currently available in the CN social media. So we don't know if the rewards and compensation mentioned here will also apply to global users, um, but they should. And I agree with that. Um, the, if, if something's happening in CN, we should also get the same compensation as the game was dropped at the same time um it's not like a a, a a different scenario to other games where maybe the cn version comes out earlier than the global version they came out the same time so we should get the same compensation so the highlights of this post is we're going to be getting 10 rating tide to be sent as compensation on the 25th and also we're going to be getting a standard character selector to be sent as compensation on the 26th of may and the new selector will be available for a year so everyone who starts playing the game between now and 2025 will receive the selector and a skip function will be added to more story missions so this is going to be really good as you guys know uh if you play genshin you, you ain't able to skip the story same with honkai star rail you have to watch that shit. so now they're adding a skip function for people who can skip the story if they ain't interested in the story which is a fair uh so next we'll go over the full translations right here so this is the announcement on the game experience issues and ongoing optimization. So, dear drifters, since the launch of since the launch of Wuthering Waves, we have received numerous feedback from players regarding the game experience issues. We deeply apologize for not providing a better gaming experience. We will address these issues upcoming up in upcoming updates to improve the game current content. As a token of our apology, we will distribute an additional compensation on May 25th at 10 UTC. Compensation 10 rating tied and players who created a character before july 3rd at 339 have a union level greater than two so you have to have a union level more than two and an account before july 3rd so that's pretty much everyone right now unless you just made made a new brand new spanking account um so in addition to ongoing performance optimizations here are some specific adjustments and future development priorities so number one optimization of the skip function so to address feedback regarding limited skip functions, unclear skip button display, and lengthy main storyline, we will modify the skip button icon. Two, significantly expand the skip range of the main storyline, including skipping the prologue and the first act. Three, support skipping stationary dialogues. And four, open resonators, Yinlin's companion tasks soon. Ooh. So due to technical limitations, skipping cutscenes in the storyline is currently not feasible. We appreciate your understanding. Okay. So number two, optimization of combat experience. So to improve combat experience based on feedback about weak heat feedback, poor controller mode experience, and vision obstruction during battles, we will conduct specialized optimizations for various combat scenarios to enhance positive feedback during combat. So improve co co uh, controller functions and address issues with the delayed customization options and then here finally we have the thank you select selectable permanent five star character in response to feedback on the new summon uh, new player summon event we apologize for the unsatisfactory experience on may 26th um at 10 utc we'll send a special item tight sound thank you ticket to all players via mail this can be used to obtain a selectable permanent five star character this event is valid until May 22nd, 20, uh, 2025, uh, 11.59 UTC. Please refer to the in-game announcement for detailed rules. And four, ongoing development and more optimizations and version content. So we will continue to optimize the game content and develop new features and events, such as enhancing some NPC art resources, adding a layered map feature, introducing more resonator transformation gameplay. And we are aware that Wuthering Waves still has many areas for improvement but we will continue to refine the game content and experience thank you for your attention and support 
um honestly so this is really good news honestly i i i, I haven't personally experienced um major bugs or issues with the game um from 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 my perspective but what i'm seeing here is the game's only been out like three days people have complained about certain issues and like a good company should they're addressing them immediately and they're giving us insane compensation for the issues like i don't know if you guys play i don't know if you guys ever gotten um temp temples as compensation in genshin like back to back to back like we're getting temples for every single compensation that's actually crazy so anytime there's a bug or anything we're getting temples and also with the the optimizing the skip function which is really nice and the combat experience is some issues with controller that they say they're going to fix that and this selectable five star again is they don't even have to do this like they, this is completely out of the kindness of their hearts they don't even need to give us a, another five star selector it's completely unnecessary but it's a really really nice reward to show that sincerity and that they're willing to make changes and they're really 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 trying their best and that's what's the most important with these gacha games is, is if the dev team is willing to make changes and listen out to the community and they have done an amazing job of the of, of doing that so yeah i re i'm really interested in seeing what happens with withering waves i uh, expect another video coming out today if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more withering waves news and updates gameplay tips everything withering waves uh don't forget to join us in the discord lions pride and until next time take care and peace guys